Hello you guys, how's it going? So today I want to talk about something a little more serious. I want to talk about um, insecurity and how I've overcome it. Because I used to be really insecure about myself for just many reasons, you know, and I've really overcome it. And nowadays I don't give two about what people say about me so I just kind of want to talk about this and kind of um, see if I can really help any of you out there that are facing insecurity and want a way out of it. So let's start out with middle school. Those are my like, kind of manly days and I say that because you know that was before makeup and you know doing my hair and all of that so one thing I do remember is that I would always wear this gray jacket. I can probably show you a picture of that. Um, I used to wear it all the time and I would never take it off. Like seriously, the only time I would take it off is for PE because I had to. I never took it off because I didn't feel comfortable without it on because I was just so insecure about myself. Also in middle school, like, you know, changing for PE, I always went into a little room and changed because I didn't want to change it from other people because, you know, I didn't want people to see like, you know, me changing, you know, but so I went in another room. Moving on to high school, um, I got a little tiny bit better. I started feeling a little tiny bit more confident in myself, not much. For a PE, I would actually change in front of people, so, you know, I was just like, okay, whatever, everyone's changing, it doesn't matter, you know, what size you are, I'm just gonna, you know, do it, get it over with really fast, you know, change, so. I did. I never really wore just a t-shirt much or anything. It's kind of like the whole thing with middle school. I always wore like a, like, I always wore a hoodie. That was mostly because like my high school was really cold <laughs> all the time, but I also just didn't want to because I felt really like people are going to see my arms, you know? So, but uh, sophomore year, I went to my first dance and I wore this dress and I can show you guys a picture of that. And I wore like this shawl over top because I didn't want my arms showing. That was the only dance I went to, by the way. Didn't even go to my prom. We won't go there. But anyway, so other things included like, I would never wear shorts. I always never wore shorts because I was so insecure about my legs, you know. I'm still not 100% happy with my legs, but I, I still wear shorts when I want to because I can and but I remember I would never wear shorts because I have like this giant birthmark on the back of my leg and I was always afraid people were gonna see that so I never wore shorts. Oh. And when I did wear shorts, people were like, whoa, you're wearing shorts. And I'm like, yeah, don't look at me though. Don't look at me. I'm trying to like cover up the birthmark with my shorts. I'm like pulling them down as much as I can. During school, I was just really insecure about myself. Just every little thing. And um, after high school, I have just gotten so much more confident in myself. I don't know what it is, but seriously, I have. Like, I wear shorts whenever, you know, it's sunny outside. And I wear tank tops in the summertime. And I just don't care what you have to say if you don't like how I look so I'm just so much more happy these days like I'm, I've always been a happy person because when I'm just sitting around like this people will come up to me like Ashley are you okay what's wrong I'm like Nothing! <laughs> Nothing's wrong. If I'm not smiling, people think I'm like either pissed off, depressed, or something. So I'm a happy person, I guess. <laughs> I don't care what people think, and that's the I think that's the best way to do it. I mean, you just live life and be yourself and you know, people should love you for who you are, not for who they think you should be. But another thing, it's just really sad these days because there's, I've, there's just like a lot of teenagers that are like insecure about themselves. I really wish there was something I could do to help them. These people are just like really like not even like, there's nothing wrong with them. They're like attractive and they're, you know, but they're so insecure about themselves that I don't know why. Like, you're awesome. So I don't know why people, some people are so insecure about themselves. I just say, if you're having problems with insecurity, just think positive thoughts and just you know tune people's opinions out of your mind like if people are gonna give you shit for like what you wear or how you look and stuff like that I think you should just like don't even acknowledge it seriously oh that's the best thing I can say like going off my bullying video I mean you just gotta ignore those haters and they just want your feedback and your attention so they can keep making fun of you so don't give in to them okay Seriously. No one should feel insecure. Everyone is beautiful in their own ways and everyone should just don't care what people say. 
That's all I'm saying, because that's how I live by these days. I'm really proud of myself for being as confident as I am these days because it's just crazy because I was never like that. Yeah, man. <laughs> so if you guys have any questions for me about insecurity, anything, leave your comments below. I want to have a discussion, you know, discussions are good. I really feel like I haven't really talked to you guys in a while, so please, please leave comments if you need any, like, advice or anything, just leave your comments and I will respond or other people will respond but I'll probably respond. Alright, so if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up. Remember to always stay positive you guys. That is the best thing you can do. It's what I live by. So um, yeah, I will see you guys next week and I hope you guys have an excellent day and all that stuff. Bye! We're just kids